Hey guys, it's me, Cruel, back again with another talking video. Um, actually wanted to do another one. I recently did one, which was more kind of like an update thing and also a little bit of a personal service announcement. It was about the orbits following my lunar series, right? But today we have actually something different. And as you can tell from the title, there's a central topic that lingers around this video, but I also want to talk about other stuff, right? Just want to let out some stuff. And if you're interested in listening, then you can. If you're not, then that's fine as well. Uh, anyway, thank you so much for listening and for tuning in, if you do. And now, um, yeah, let's just begin somewhere. So I guess elephant in the room, let's do it. I am moving. Um, yeah, by the time you're watching this, I have moved or I am about to move. I'm likely going to post this uh, at the beginning of the week, which is the, either the 4th, the 5th or the 6th of October. Um, 4th or 6th. In between those, which is Monday to mid uh, to Wednesday that week, and yeah, I'm gonna move on the Wednesday, the sixth actually, and I'm gonna move in a student dorm uh, in another city, two hours away from me. So yeah, it's it's also my first move. I've never moved. Um, I know that's for some people might be late. For some people, that's normal. I I don't mind and also don't really care. Everybody has their own life. Everybody has their own view on that. Um, you know, I have my reasons why I didn't move yet. And now I have a reason why I move, so that's about it. And the reason why I move, I will talk about a bit, for sure. I uh, definitely want to share that with you guys. Some of you might have seen on Twitter, if you follow me, about all kinds of updates I post on Europe, but I also just post random stuff, right, about my life and just K-pop in general, like just hot takes, uh, <laughs> updates of my life, and so on. And um, my light just went out. That's great. That's absolutely perfect. This video doesn't work as, as I want it to. Oh my goodness, man. Anyway, it's still kind of fine, so let's just continue, whatever. It's a bit darker than before, but it's fine. <laughs> um, okay, let's just continue. I don't want to re-record this. Um, yeah, I'm going to move because of university. I begin studying in uh, October, so since I move on the 6th, the first day is going to be the 8th, so the Friday, that same week. And I move in the student dorm, which uh, I'm going to be living with five other people. I don't know yet. No idea who. Um, I even don't even know if it's all guys or girls, uh, or like how many girls or guys. I think the the dorm actually has mixed apartments, so it's possible that it's mixed, but I don't know. Maybe it's all guys. I don't really care either way, but yeah, whatever. Um, obviously has different sides to it, both bad and good. In general, it also has both bad and good things about the move itself, and uh, yeah. I don't know what is important for you guys. I don't really know. Like I'm, I'm trying to figure out what is important. I can like I can tell you because there's literally like I could probably talk like half an hour at least if I just wanted to share some things about me uh, and about what I think is cool about it. But so what it affects you with, I guess, is that I might. I mean, obviously, I will have less time. Um, what I will study, by the way, is I will begin studying modern East Asian studies. It's called. Uh, quickly summarizing, it is a mix between three things necessarily. It is um, a language out of, I can choose between three, but I have of, of course already chosen. I can choose between Japanese, Chinese, and Korean, and I will study Korean. Surprise. <laughs> uh, actually, I was thinking about Japanese for a long, long time, but no, I decided for Korean because it's more my motivation right now, and I think motivation is really important for studying in general studying not just at university um so yeah that is the the first part of it the language i will learn the language and i'm already starting right now so uh started a few days ago by now time i'm recording this is the 28th of september and i've started a few days ago and it's going okay so far i guess i don't necessarily know how much i should practice before it starts because yeah i just don't really know so i'm just kind of doing my best in in like the stuff that I learned, having it down 100%, so at least I have something down completely, right? Um, even if that's not enough, I can catch up, I guess, but just so I have that down completely. Um, so the basic Hangul reading, writing, pronunciation, for example, uh, that's what I'm doing right now. And uh, practicing some words, um, practicing more reading, then practicing Bachim, if you know what that is, which is all a whole nother field, uh, essentially. But yeah, that's the stuff I do. Then the second part of the university course is going to be um, the mix between economy, uh, politics, and culture, and as well kind of history. So both culture and history in one, I guess, 
of uh, all three countries, so of China, Jap Japan, and Korea, which is really interesting to me, all three countries. Looking so forward to that, honestly. That's probably the thing I'm most interested in. Uh, the language is cool and all, but they already know that it's going to be really freaking tough as well. Um, I talk with, I guess, a friend now, I can call her. Uh, someone that is in the third semester, so she's literally one year ahead of me, practically. And um, they have around four, uh, actually 3,000 vocabularies by now that they have to have down all the time. And 200 pages of grammar. I don't know how, like, I, I'm not sure if that's DNA4 pages, like really big pages or like smaller, I don't know but really big, and I mean, we have a lot of books, so probably she means books, book pages, uh, so big pages, but yeah, it's a lot, uh, and that's just one thing out of three, right? So the second is what I just said with the, the culture, the politics, and the economy of all three countries, and the third is actually um, another completely different part of it, which I can choose between three, and I chose economy essentially again, but on a more general purpose, like globally, I guess. Um, so in that sense, uh, all kinds of things, right? Even I learn a lot about the law as well, about marketing and so on. So all kinds of things, uh, math, of course, of course. But yeah, um, this is going to be my course and I will have less time, obviously, but I wanted to let you know about that and I'm moving as well. So the combination of movement or movement of the move and new city, first move ever in my life, first time living alone, I guess, alone in a sense. Um, of course, the, the course as well, the study course, which is going to take a lot of time. I will have less time. That's one thing. The second time is I might not upload much the week I'm moving, or at least for a few days. I have to set up everything. I don't know if I have internet uh, the first day already. It really also depends on if there's already someone that moved in or not, and they set it up already or not, right? Uh, and there's also good and bad things about that I'm actually kind of worried about, because we have essentially unlimited internet capabilities but we can also buy really bad internet if you want to because it's cheaper but we can also get the best one in germany so i just i'm kind of worried that the people living there or maybe moved in a day earlier or something they already bought a contract or signed a contract for kind of bad internet just because they don't really need it and they think that's fine or like good enough but it's cheaper right so i'm a bit worried about that because i obviously want really good internet uh, I have lived on, if you don't know about internet speed, I have lived on uh, 6 megabit per second download and 0 0.7 megabit per second upload my whole life. And I don't want that anymore. I, you know, uh, uploading videos takes hours and hours and hours uh, for Patreon. Patreon episode takes two hours, uh, two hours. Two hour episodes take like 10 hours to upload. So I always do it overnight. Um, I can't stream, stuff like that. You can't even watch a stream sometimes in 180p. Yeah, it's it's miserable. Um, can't play tons of games because of that as well. Yeah. Anyway, looking forward to the move, um, but it's going to take some time for me. Yeah, uh, that's about it, I think, from what I wanted to let you know. Um, I'm pre-recording a lot of stuff, so... Um, I don't know up until which point I will pre-record. I might pre-record up until two weeks in the future, so... By the time you're watching this, the next two weeks might already completely be pre-recorded. And I mean, obviously, you can see that from this room, right? The room will look different after I move. <laughs> obviously, it's obvious. Uh, I hope I can somewhat make it look similar. At least I, because I really like my setup with the posters. Uh, and just in general that I have a space to put on something here. I hope I can somewhat make it look similar, but we will see. Um, I have to buy a lot of new furniture and stuff like that. And just as the time goes on, I will see what happens. But uh, yeah, uh, all the videos you see with this room background still, of course, I have not moved at that point where I recorded, but uh, it could be by the time, like today, by the time I upload this video, is going to be the day, every, every video from now on could also be already from my new home, which uh, I hope obviously I will have time for YouTube and Patreon on top of my university. And I think I can, because there's also people that work part-time jobs, of course, so uh, I just can't put in as much time as before, which is sad, but also necessary because to balance both, I have to do that. But yeah, thanks so much for listening. If you have any questions, if you want to know more as well, uh, I can definitely dive deeper into that and just explain more or just share some thoughts or like how I learned Korean, if you're interested in that. Let me know. Um, also, I would really like to know for anybody that's still watching, 
would you be willing to watch streams and if so like what time zone would you want stream to be in like at what time or like maybe let me know what time zone you're from i don't know if that makes more sense or if i want to know at what what time i can stream so obviously i can't stream daytime because like like daytime daytime because i have university i can stream on the weekends that's one thing for sure um and i can stream on the evening which i'm from europe meaning that is evening time is uh i don't know like what is the time in america right now let me see i know it's a lot of americans here so right now it's <laughs> everywhere from kind of i guess 1 p.m to 4 4 p.m right now and it's 10 p.m for me so 9 9 to 6 hours difference so yeah i mean that's daytime in in uh, usa for sure when i would stream because i would probably stream at like 7 7 to 10 or something i would assume like in and that time frame at least i'm not I'm not saying that I will stream three hours. If I don't know if I have the time to do it, but um, in that time frame, I would probably stream. So yeah, something like that. So you can look up, I guess, Germany time. Just look up, uh, I don't know, eight p.m. for example. What what that time that is for you, and tell me if that works, because I would be kind of interested to know about some people if they could join, if they want to, if they could join, right? But obviously, what I will do, um, if you're part of my Patreon lineup, um, I will obviously upload all of the vods i will record them and i will upload all of them on patreon um so you can watch them whenever you want so either you can watch them for free live i guess right or you watch them for two dollars a month uh, on patreon and if you're already a patreon it's i guess whatever to you but yeah um that's i guess my talking video for today i have other things that swirl around in my head but i don't to make don't want to make this too too long just wanted to tell you a bit of about the move and what is coming again i'm moving on the 6th um, of october meaning that and also my my university course starts at the 8th so two days later meaning i will probably not have as much time in october in general i will need to get used to everything right and try to balance both things out a little bit um and the more i get used to that the better or the more efficient i will probably become with that um and at first, I'm probably going to put more time in the university just because I think it's necessary. And I just first have to see if I put in a lot of time in university, how does that turn out, right? Like, am I ahead in time? Or like, do I actually need to put in that much time? Right? I have to like figure it out for myself first before I can actually promise you guys anything in terms of uploads. Um, like, there's possibilities for everything. It could happen that... I just can't upload every day anymore, which I have been doing for two years now, uh, more than two years, two, almost two and a half years now, every single day. There were two breaks I had because I was sick, um, but they were both only a few days. So literally three or four days, that's about it. I have never had any more breaks. Uh, I have not missed a day. So I don't know if that's actually realistic to do, in particular because of Patreon as well. You now my Patreon takes up about three and a half to four hours a week only recording time only recording time not reading messages replying to messages posting polls stuff like that so i need much more work actually so yeah anyway we will see about that i'm just gonna let you know that for the time being that's gonna be a bit less and uh, the good thing about it is if everything works out then I actually find time to film more again then i will have much 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 better internet i mean I will already have better internet, that's for sure. It just depends on how much better. That's like the definition, right? But I mean, it can't get worse than what I have right now. The only thing that could be worse is I don't have internet, which I guess could have been a thing as well for a few days or a week. By the time I move in, it could take a few days. That's also a thing. But um, either way, it should be better, meaning I should be able to do more videos or like more efficiently than before. And obviously, I should be able to stream which is kind of like two things in one, which is really good for me. I could stream how I watch K-dramas and then re-upload that on Patreon as well, if you feel me. But yeah, uh, anyway, that is it. Let's end it here. Thank you so much for watching before it gets to 15 minutes. Have a nice day and see you back in 
another city in another room. But same me. Peace.